Okay, so apparently Dollar General brand batteries really suck. So I'm going to have to do this as quick as possible. So I'm going to go back out to the main menu. Whenever you change the menus, it's going to display some sort of a, uh, an animation if you want. You can really set it to whatever you want to do. But uh, I wanted to show you real quick. Well, I guess I'll do Super Nintendo first since I was already there. If you're in a system, when you launch the system, it's going to do this animation first, but then after it does that animation, they'll go dark. And in Super Nintendo, all of the uh, games are going to light up the same animation. We've got red, green, blue, and uh, yellow, and then the shoulder buttons and the start button are white. But this is what it's called a demo. Each one of these uh, games is going to do the demo. But it's a little bit different when you go into main because main is set up to be different for each game. Now, what it displays is defined by what's in the colors.ini file. So you can either add games or change uh, what they do. Now myself, I, uh, I usually use Street Fighter as my test ROM or test game. And oddly enough, that's one of the ones that lights up the buttons. Now currently it's set for green, blue, green, which I don't remember. I don't think Street Fighter had that in the originals. So uh, you can change that in the file, but then other ones don't have it. I'll, I'll do a thing in another video that should help you out with that. Um, I'm going to go through the whole setup of LED Blinky because it was a super pain in the butt and I really couldn't find anything good on the internet. So uh, I guess that's it for now.